Hey guys, and welcome back to Diablo 4. You've returned. The old ruins are clear. Your town should be safe now. Truly. Ha! Huh. By the light, you are heaven sent. Oh, I'm so sorry. We, we haven't any coin to offer. But we have hot stew, good company, and... Stay for a pint. Wash out the taste of the stew. <laughs> <laughs> We'd be honored if you'd join us. So I guess it's party time. What's that dancing? <laughs> <laughs> Just like head bob the whole time. I don't know why I'm bobbing my head right now. You guys can't see it. These guys went to like party mode pretty fast. All like five of them in the town. Oh, that's not good. Big boy can't hold his liquor. What's that noise? That seemed awfully convenient. And they have me like halfway on it too. Like 250 pound dude who's like partially on this cart and one guy is gonna pull it. That's attractive. So they, I guess they set me up. Kind of confused as what they gain out of this. Unless I'm like some sort of sacrifice. Because I don't think they like got anything from me. Outside of basically getting me wasted. What is this, like a crematorium or? Didn't they mention somebody else? Going crazy or something similar to what we did. By mother's blood, by mother's body. So uh, shall you witness her glory before you Flower die. Flower petals? <laughs> oh, that's ominous. There's a lot of blood on the front on the floor. I hope that's mud. Uh, not ready yet. Who's this guy? Oh. Candlestick to the head by Professor Plum. They're coming. The whole damned village. Get up. Hey Joseph, that's Get the guy up. from earlier, right? We have to fight our way out. There! Take them! May the light preserve us. Lost so I guess now we're ass kicking mode. So we gotta beat all like what five of them. This whole town. Going wolf smash on him. Have to stop to get loot. Come on. I don't care what it is. I have to stop to get my loot. Oh, another one. You are oh. blessed, my 
fuck off. She's the last one. <sighs> that was all of them. Light wheeling. Madman. Those heretics drugged me after I returned from the ruins. Just like you. I came to my wits and escaped. Tried to get inside the chapel, but it was logged and... Gross. <coughs> Puking flower petals. What manner of evil is this? Petals? Of blood? Oh, weird. And gross. They, they must have fed them to me. A blasphemous ritual. How did they learn this? Perhaps the answer lies in the chapel. They kept it locked up for a reason. The key might be on that woman who was leading them. All right, we got the chapel key. So I guess he's the guy that they were talking about. Oh, this is going to get bad. We have to do a lot of spring cleaning. I have to figure this bag situation. Sorting, I feel like it just puts all the ducks in the rows. I don't think it gives you the option of putting them like high low or anything. Which is unfortunate. That's going to be a problem. Um. I feel like this is familiar. Yeah. Another thing I don't like about these games is I have like OCD, so I have to clear out like the map. Can't leave any little faded corners. All right, so like 20 minutes later, let's go back to where the guy was. Guess we're gonna go to the chapel. Only fire can cleanse the darkness in this place. Have a look inside, but hurry. I will prepare the torch. Oh, more. Is this real? Bunch of them on the ground. Oh, cutscene. Our father has granted you a path to salvation. <laughs> and yet, you stray from it at every opportunity. You he seems angry. And gamble. You covet and steal. Shameful. And disappointed. Oh, blood pedal. Well, who left the window open? Sin is that birthright. <gasps> that was a hard landing. The Lords of Hell are coming to devour our world. 
Salvation lies not in the light, but in you. The faith has taught you to deny your heart's desire and turned you into a prisoner within yourself. Break the chains and discover who you were meant to be. Break the chains and be beautiful in sin. I feel like that should be a shirt. Resist. Resist her that didn't take long, man. These people were. Oh. Oh. Ouch. Vani, it's me. They were easily I convinced. Your child into this world. The hell's wrong with these people? see why he was disappointed in them. Jesus Christ. They are psychopaths. It did not take much to convince these people at all. Where did they get all the weapons? They have awakened, mother. If they awakened, I think they the stirred them up. Of many. Go to the dry steps and continue your preparations now our true work begins man you came to they went to town on him i don't think there's anything left Collapsed inside. I thought that darkness had swallowed you. I dragged you here and put this cursed place to the torch. What happened to you in there? I saw a vision. A horned demon. She said the lords of hell are coming. She wanted to help the people survive. Help them? She called them her children, and they welcomed her like a mother. Like mother. psychopaths? No, it cannot be. I must report to the cathedral. Listen, there is a hermit to the northeast, a man of questionable loyalty. A hermit? Oh, I thought he said he a helmet. Forbidden. He might be useful to us. Bring him to the cathedral in Kiovashad. And you will be in the light's favor. You overshed. Level five. Prayer for salvation. Oh. Hardcore wolf action already. Let's get our anger management out. Well. This has had a lot of story involved. First episode, not as much. It was more of like a tutorial. This one though. Like the majority of it has been cutscenes and story beats. So far, the game is still running somewhat smooth. Every now and again, had a frame skip or something, some some micro issue. Really, nothing. But I still feel like we're like in a linear path. Like we haven't got to a major hub world or seen any other 
users. I guess we'll see how that gets when we arrive. All right, well, we can't go through that way, so we're gonna have to go around another way. I think it was like a path behind the chapel where he was at. Yeah. Not while I'm in town. Not while I'm in town. Oh, just a pair of shoes sitting on that table. This is slowly piling up here. I feel like when we get into some really involved dungeon, we are going to be SOL. We need to reach a merchant ASAP. One that we preferably haven't killed yet. So we can actually sell all our goodies. Do the typical uh, ARPG loot and dump. There's so much. Oh, can we go in here? Okay, we can. Ice sworn cellar. Is it just smashables everywhere here? I feel like everything should break. Oh, enemies. Kind of digging the this like wind push. Actually feels pretty good, honestly. Oh, and then he gets me with some ice thing. Oh, he died. Not much in here. Not fully sure if that was worth my trouble. Just a couple gold. I don't even remember if there was anything that uh was dropped to him. Alright, I guess we'll mosey on. This is the dangerous part of kind of having not an open world, but an open sandbox area. This is where I could spend really extended amount of time. Just looting and pillaging everything. But it's a double-edged sword, no pun intended, because the your inventory will get consumed fast. As you can see, like in a blink of an eye, I think we started like half full and now we're getting pretty close to being full. Doesn't take much. And I have a feeling if we get roped into like a quest, like a dungeon quest, we will uh, be maxed out. I uh, hope you guys have been able to play this. I know the queue times have been a little ridiculous depending on what time uh, you try to play. But uh, pretty fun. When you're in, it's good. I'm not a fan of the server time. games. Ooh. This guy was a little more difficult than the last ones. Um, I kind of wish server games didn't do that, especially in the beginning. I feel like a major waste if they were able to figure out how to do like the the tutorial level while it was loading that would have been fantastic because we're still at a point where it's linear single player technically offline at this point we're not interacting with anything online so i feel like waiting in a queue to play this for like the first hour 
we're losing out on that. We're losing time too. All right, so we have our shields and swords. Ooh. Yeah, I really am digging this wind attack. Whatever, I don't remember what it's called. It doesn't feel OP, but it's a pretty solid tactic. I cannot wait until I can unlock uh, more ability slots because I'm also kind of missing the werewolf. Right now, I'm kind of enjoying everything. Like, I like the lightning on my uh, regular. Oh, I hit. What is it? Deer? <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Um. Yeah, I like the your base lightning attack when you strike anything. But then also like the shape shifting. Oh, I hit another one. I'll take my rage out on these skeletons. Oh, the shield one's a little more difficult. these tombstones something i enjoy doing in diablo and other games that have uh graveyards you always kind of do it because you think maybe there might be an achievement or something for it i don't think there ever is all right some more wangs or are they wargs Wings will be hilarious. I think there's wargs in uh, Witcher. Hey, opened. Fractured Peaks. Dissolute Highlands. Fighters. I mean, it's not an ARPG unless there's spiders. Kind of knew that from the first blink of the eye. What's that big dude? Spider host? That's interesting. You don't see that. That's a new one. You usually have spider and their spider babies. Your typical, uh, RPG Western RPG tropes The last one I was playing that had a bunch of spiders was a uh, Hogwarts legacy My bags are full. His bags are full well, We might play that one eventually once uh, The optimization gets kind of ironed out Quite honestly, I think we jumped a gun on Gotham Knights. Like it was getting is getting better. But I think we might have started it like the current update was probably a better time anymore. to start it. Not like two updates ago. Cause it was still having points of where just out of nowhere it would uh lag spike. But I think it's a decent update currently between those and like uh graphics card updates i really wish that this organized better i'm hoping they update it and you can actually sort with different ways like different filters maybe ascend and descend i'm really not a fan of like probably just me but i don't like how your compare or even just your regular just your stats 
seems to kind of just like free flow i would absolutely love it if it just stayed on the left the whole time but eventually when we go to the go to the left it's going to bounce to the right and uh and some like gray areas in the middle it will then like flip flop not a fan of that especially when you're kind of like going through really quick to see what's high and low with your current gear and you got the little pop up dealy bouncing left and right on you it's a little aggro and you gotta consider the fact too that like you can't when you when you pause it's the game's still going on so i would much rather spend less time and hey, there's a lot of spiders here oh get out of the way um, hit the last one hide gloves I think we've properly broke everything. Oh, a bunch of gold. I wish real life was like that. Like overturn a rock, move the trash can. And there's gold. That would be way too convenient. Smash. Oh. I missed a couple. Oh, babies. Oh, bats. Vampire bats. They want to suck my blood. Not today. Hatchlings. Well, at least you know that like I'm actually hitting something because <laughs> for the longest time it didn't look like it. I knew I was hitting something. And on my end, I wasn't really sure how much damage I was doing. Oh, we got traver traversing. That's traversal. They're very generous on uh, health potions everywhere. Again, I thought maybe four seemed a little low, but you kind of come across them pretty frequently. Yeah, this inventory is starting to become a bugger here. And then sorting it just kind of puts it all in the rows, but it doesn't really sort it the way I want to sort it. I kind of want to do it like high, low. And it's sort of doing it now, but I think just by accident. Because I don't think my head garments are uh, necessarily my most expensive, but it seems to have all my low stuff on the bottom, which is nice. At least I can kind of quick dump those if i need to i say if but when i need to so i guess traversing or not so much like press jump or something it's more or less uh just hitting the button when you're in the area which is fine it's better than nothing it's a different change it's kind of like adding a different dimension to the stuff Oh, so many of them. So we have a host and we got three spiders. Oh god, and then the babies. When you kill the host and all the babies come out. Not a party I want to go to. Gross. I don't have arachnophobia, just not a fan of them. I, I could do without giant spiders and giant rats and insects and whatnot. 
in my video games. I feel like they're uh, too prevalent in real life. But I guess that's why. Because, I mean, I guess a lot of people have phobias against them. So let's freak them out in the game. So many health potions. Crazy. And if you can stack as many, you'd probably have like 40 by now. We're going to climb down, and I think it's just basically where we were, so. An X. Kind of paranoid now that I have so many things, because I have to, like, always prepare to dump something. Really wish that it would sort, it, sort the way I wanted to sort it. I like the details so far. I like the, the wind blowing the snow sideways. I like the lighting. Um, shadows are nice. Very, very dark as a Diablo game should be. Diablo 3, for the most part, was kind of a dark game as well, but I feel like this is dark and more than just colors. I really hope we can expand that uh, inventory slot because uh, having what, like 30 is not enough. I think it's 30. I, I haven't counted yet. Just kind of feel a little bit overwhelmed every time I look I at it. I cannot carry anymore. I cannot carry anymore. I right on cue because so many things. I think it's like 12 per row. Yeah, we're on that one. Still, for a game like this, this is not enough. Okay, so now we're getting resources for crafting. Something new. I mean, we still technically are doing tutorial stuff. Kind of like the shapeshifter. I mean, I might start another playthrough, if not like two more, and try other characters. But I really kind of wanted to try this one because he's seemed like a new one for the shapeshifting and everything. So, I'm like, try to figure out. boots crash some of our low level stuff you can accumulate so much and personally I don't like throwing things away I like to sell things like I'm sure you've noticed in the division and, uh, kingdoms of Amler I don't know if we got to that extent yet on that laser from a while back but I'd much rather break things down for resources than just dropping things. But we are still in the tutorial level, so I'm not sure how long we're going to go before we reach a certain town and come across a merchant that we haven't murdered yet. Um, we're still looking for the hermit. has to be like the only house looking thing at this point and we've got a good bit without actually having any enemies as well roads blocked should clear roads blocked past. i think we're actually circling his house might as well just continue doing these things before we go
see if uh let's get some of the resources here oh don't hit the deer he still hit the deer He does not gonna like Diablo. I mean, hell, they didn't like Animal Crossing. So, go figure that one. Is anyone here? What are you hiding back here? So, being like we're in the middle of nowhere, I'm guessing it's this guy's house. But a lot of the stuff is pretty crazy right now. Short fangs, young, specimens, and an easy kill. Blood everywhere. Further south than the others. They're spread. Uh oh, someone's heading home. If you're going to trespass into my home, rifle through my things. Then at least have the decency to join me for supper. I'm bloody hungry. Oh, this guy's nice. I would like to. That's quite break in and enter in a house and. I wish it was happen to have this hospitable response. <laughs> Why did I have this? Can I go through somebody's crap and? Thank those friends. Here, I'll cook you food. They gave you the blood of Lilith. The blood of a demon. Not just any demon. The daughter of hatred. The mother of sanctuary. She was banished ages ago. But this world is her creation. <sighs> it was prophesied she would come back. What does she want? That's the question. Sanctuary has always been trapped amid the eternal conflict. A war between angels and demons. But Lilith serves neither side. She has her own plans for us. And me? Am I corrupted? Not sure yet. But you two share a connection. What will you do about it? Use it. Find out what she's Yeah, after. make a decision already. Good. Then we're in this together. Rest while you can. Then we'll start in Kiovashad. If we can't stop Lilith, we'll all be damned. Dun dun dun. All right, guys. Well, I think that'll be it for this episode. Uh, we'll catch you in the next one. Hopefully, we'll get another one out before the weekend. Later.